Hello, I'm Ember. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing well today. It's quite late, so I'm trying to be a little bit quiet. I just finished the 2024 guide to and hypen about an hour ago. I took about an hour's break. I'm still feeling a little bit meh, you know, glum, but I thought it would be nice to try my very first N O'Clock episode. So, there was a request that came through recommending episodes and in typical engine fashion we have had trouble narrowing down the episode i was told the ones that are recommended are 1 2 5 8 to 13 18 to 20 22 and 23 31 to 35 38 39 49 to 53 55 59 to 61 66 to 70 73 to 75 80 Oh, 78 to 81, 83 to 90, and the only reason they didn't recommend anything from 90 onwards is because they haven't watched that far yet. Now that is a lot of episodes, that's like half of them, <laughs> but I, uh, again, you know, I can definitely see why it's hard to narrow down content with these guys because it is all so good. My friend did very kindly put together a list for me with a, a just a one-line summary of what those episodes are about, just so that I've got like a little list to refer to so that I can jump in between. And then on my recommended page, there's this one, episode 44, which is not one of the ones that was recommended. And it looks like this one is like a horror type one. Uh, so that that's what we're working with. However, I do believe I know which one I want to start with because I've seen it pop up in the guide and I've mentioned a few times that I would be interested in checking it out. So I think we're going to start with uh, episode 20, uh, which should be ice skating. <laughs> so this one was released two years ago, so like, what, 2022 sometime? And we're just going to go into it, my first... My first variety content episode for Enhypen. Subtitles probably helpful. Yeah, we saw this in the guide, right? The first guide I watched. This is such a pretty song that it's like a really nice one to have for the skating.
Oh, he looks happy when he's skating too. Bless him. I like how they're called N kids. <laughs> Matches their chaotic energy. <laughs> Fast passing down. <laughs> I just want to take someone down with them. And toddlers. <laughs> They're going backwards. Next, there'll be N babies. They're <laughs> walking like penguins with their arms out. <laughs> Very cute. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Just slow slide to the ground. I'm going to go to the ground. Hell yeah, you're learning. 
상태에서 이렇게 우와 오. 이 상태에서 이렇게 우와 항상 중심은 앞에 오 봐봐 봐봐 그러니까 오, 뭐야 중심 오, 앞에 이상해. 오, 이게 다잘 사네. 이 o 이 doing really well. He was the person I thought was the professional skater in the guide because I saw him skating and I was like, oh, it must be him. He's just really good at it too. It's kind of sweet to see Sung Hoon like looking around at everyone, kind of like proud, slightly amused. <laughs> I will say before we continue, not only is it like really cool to see like Sung Hoon teaching them a little bit and, and kind of encouraging them and kind of looking around at everyone, like <laughs> keeping an eye on everyone as they're learning and doing their own thing and giving them tips. But another way to like tell just how amazing he is at skating other than everything we've seen so far, no matter what the person he's holding on to, like it whatever they do he is fine so he was saying like the first rule don't push or pull people don't grab them if you're going down like they're gonna come down with you stuff like that but when he was like guiding people and they were holding on to him it didn't matter if the person went too fast if they started leaning backwards if they like twirled at one point i think it was maybe jungwon i don't know like actually fell down and held on to sunghoon as he was falling down not once in any of those moments did Sung Hoon lose balance, go down like with anyone, anything like that. It doesn't matter like how much they messed up while they were holding on to him. He was perfectly balanced the entire time. Like if you just watch him, like he never loses any kind of composure. So that's really interesting to see as well that it doesn't matter how unpredictable someone is and they're like holding on to him. He can just like shift his weight, balance his way through it. He's really like incredible on the ice. It's insane. <laughs> oh, scoring wow. points. Wait, that was so fast though. First place, ten points. Second place, nine. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, That's wow. fine. How do I have a guy? How do I have a guy? I Beep, beep, 
It doesn't seem like it would be that easy even without the ice. They're not exactly very big hoops. <laughs> so confident. <laughs> Competitive kitty. <laughs> <laughs> you were saying? Hell <laughs> yeah, go on, Jay. Damn. Something is kind of amazing, no? He even stopped that quickly right by the line. My gosh. It does look so cool. The back of Nikki's coat is covered in ice from being like absolutely covered in the the shaved ice of him skating. <laughs> you know, just because you can skate good, don't mean you can throw hoops good. <laughs> I don't know if it's just me being bad at recognizing them still, but Nikki looks so different to me that I didn't. I really struggled to recognize him. He just looks so different for some reason. You just need one. You can do it. Worst person on the ice to begin with, but he gonna win the game. <laughs> Hell yeah. Very cool. I salute Oh my gosh. Surely Sung Hoon wins this though. It's all about like the skating and not falling over, right? So cool. <laughs> Proper ice print. <laughs> Oh, 
아, 줄줄이 할까요? 어, 줄줄이 할까? 그냥 서가지고 아, 줄줄이 가는 거예요? And they've all kind of picked it up by now, no? They're all skating pretty confidently. Kind of. <laughs> nice. Now you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Not quite as cool. <laughs> nice. He's definitely the second most confident person on the ice, I feel like. He does look like he's been skating most of his life, too. <laughs> I think he should get extra points for having a spin at the end. <laughs> that was style point. Damn, so he went through fast. Has to be Sunu. Look how low down he can go. He has to be able to do it. Let's go. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> Jay goes so slowly too. It's like when a kid throws a bowling ball and it takes like five hours to get to the pins. <laughs> Getting to the point where you do kind of need to lean back to make it, I feel like. Let's <laughs> 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 say maybe Sanu will get it. He can go really like, he, he just hands into this tiny little ball <laughs> and it seems to work. <laughs> Sungkun always looks cool when he does his, his turn. <laughs> nice. It's got to be between Sunghoon, he sung, and Sunu, surely. <laughs> it just becomes this tiny little ball. He might make it, you know. Let's go. Whoa. 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 His knee isn't touching the ice. Bonk. You can't blame me, right? When I was watching the guide for thinking he sung was the pro skater, he's very confident. <laughs> oh, he failed it. Oh. It was nearly a winning strategy. Oh, they just made them tie. Nah, they should have kept going. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
가겠습니다. 이번엔 진짜 미스터 쇼 at the end. What Jake said was true, slow and steady wins the race. Just don't send the puck flying and you're going to be fine. <laughs> <laughs> so how are they going to give him a handicap? Oh, okay. Just because he can skate doesn't mean that he can control the puck while he's skating, right? Yeah. It's gonna be close. Damn, that was close. The thing is as well, it's only a handicap depending on how you look at it, because you've got a longer distance to go, but the cones are further apart. So he was able to kind of do a very, like a very smooth line like that. Whereas when the cones are closer together, you do have to do more left and right movements. So actually, it's only kind of a handicap because <laughs> he does get the advantage of being able to do like closer to a straight line to get around the cones. That was very close. Wow. <laughs> 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 Oh, 
Damn. Only 10 seconds? <laughs> I will say, the, the rock, paper, scissors thing does make sense, making it completely random that you can't say that there's any, like, unfairness. But whoever suggested Jay goes with Hisung, it was actually a really good idea as well. I feel like that would that would be a good pair up to make it fair. Wait, 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 what are the Jake, Jungwon and Nikki? Hisung and Jay do end up on the same team. Sunu. Balanced, no? I feel oh, like. Kazi,大丈夫だよ。自信を持たないで。私は持たない。あ、いや、あんた、いや、ディキア、うんぺばり。どうしたの、先生。テイヨン様、よし。え、그렇게 <laughs> 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 안 yeah, I'm worried about Nikki. When he does fall, he looks like he's gonna hurt himself. He almost always goes face first. <laughs> Please be careful. He must have skated before this. In no way he that confident right off the bat. I know he's the ace, but come on now. <laughs> Rule number one. <laughs> Don't push a ball. Don't grab people on the way down. Here he comes. <laughs> He is just fucking sprinting, you see that? Holy shit. <laughs> Bonkers. He, he just go win. I said only 10 seconds. I'm tell I knew it. <laughs> I knew he needed longer. Should have made him wait for 30 and even then I think he might have won it. Wait. Yeah, he still wins it. I feel like that's predictable. Although Sanu did so well as well. Interesting. Yeah, they they all did pretty well until you get to like <laughs> Yeah. Here <Head> downwards. <laughs> a little bit a little bit rough, I feel like. The way that they could have made the relay race fair, so that that they could have made it m like two teams of four and Sunghoon is on both teams. So they do it one at a time and time it rather than they actually race together. Might not have been as fun, but it would have been more fair, right? So Sung Hoon would help the first team of three and it would go like one, two, three, four. And then you do it with the second team and it would be one, two, three, four with Sung Hoon again. Potentially the only way that you could make that fair. But then you don't get the chaos that is two people falling down. <laughs> He's so cool. Free ice cream. 
와 대강기 이동 소장은 뭐야? 아, 재밌겠다. 와 대강기 이동 소장은 뭐야? 아, 재밌겠다. 와. 뭐야? 와 귀엽다. 다리 형이랑 잘 어울린다. 뭐 저거 침대에다 갖다 놔요. 뭐 이거 쓰는 거예요? 쓰면 돼요 이거? 야 왕자라고 또. 오. 잘잘 <웃음> Now he's the real ice prince. 솔직히 쉽게 이길 줄 알았는데 좀 어려웠어. 너무 쉽게 이겼는데. 마지막. 아까 아까 림보가 진짜 치열해 가지고. 아 진짜. 스킨 타면서 이렇게 It helps that the other two took each other out. <웃음> 생각보다 어려웠다. 그러니까 생각보다 어려웠어. 아, 네. 진짜 오랜만에 와서 너무 재밌었어. 진짜. 그 진짜, 진짜 어, 재밌는데요? 진짜 너무 재밌어 스케이트. 피가 더 배우고 싶어요. 진짜. 진짜. 과연 다음 주에 얼마나 더 스펙타클하게? 야, <웃음> <웃음> 네 그럼 지금까지 재밌습니다. 안녕. u e s they're all adorable. <웃음> Happy holiday. Happy holiday. Happy holiday. 저 도넛 먹을래요. 이분 취하는 거 아니에요? 혹시 <웃음> 취할 것 같은데? 혼술. <웃음> Is that? The episode from the guide where Nikki was, he had the ball or something like that, and he called to He Sung to play ball with him. And He Sung was like, Oh, gotta go play. <laughs> and it was like the way he said it was so adorable. Because I recognize the, the set, I feel like. I think it's, it was a Christmas episode that that clip was from. I love in variety shows kind of chaotic, funny things like this. And normally it does come from like, Physical activities, mini games. Um, that is like my favorite type of variety show. I don't mind the puzzle type ones, like escape rooms and um, like the mafia games, stuff like that. I don't mind them, but they're not my favorite. I do prefer like mini games, physical games, challenges where it's just chaos and that people are falling over and there's it's just it's so great. So this is definitely. A really good introduction to their variety show. I did see, I think in the 2024 guide, there was a clip of they were doing like the whisper challenge with the headphones, like the lip reading and stuff like that. And that's one of my favorite variety show contents to watch. It's always hilarious. I don't know if that's part of N O'Clock. It could be the one N two D thing. Uh, my friend is saying that that they do do that in the that series as well. I don't know if it's also in N O'Clock. Someone can tell me, but I would love to watch the full video for the like whisper challenges, the headphone challenge, things like that. That was so great. Sung Hoon is so cool on the ice. I actually went back and rewatched the music video for Drunk Day. Is it Drunk Days? Where the all the blood <laughs> at the end. I think it is. And um, someone had commented on that saying it was Sung Hoon doing the dancing in that room and it looked like he was figure skating. So I actually went back and rewatched it and it, it does look so cool. I just really like the figure skating side of him. I think that it, it's like such a charismatic thing and he just looks so happy when he's on the ice and so confident and comfortable and so elegant. I, I don't know, it was great. I think one of the people who probably struggled the most was Jay, but you can see him like improving as the video is going along and as he's learning and stuff. So I had people that like when they just fell on the ground, I was just laughing and it was just adorable. And then there were people like Jay where like I could see that they were improving and trying hard to learn. And I was just like really proud. I was like, oh, look at you go. <laughs> that was so great. But yeah, Sung Hoon winning definitely expected. He sung again, I think that because the guide went in like age order except obviously Jung Won was first. Uh I watched the He Sung section before Sung Hoon's section and there was a very small clip of him like skating on the ice from this episode where he is going quite fast. So I was like, oh he must be the professional skater dude. Watching him in this video, you can't blame me for thinking that, right? Like he he was fairly confident. I don't know if he has done like one or two sessions before of like casual skating or if he just picked it up really damn fast but he he was like keeping up with Sung Hoon at one point going around like he, he was going really quickly so he's got the confidence there that he's not gonna fall flat on his face so yeah he was a really good skater too honestly every time Nikki fell over it was just it just looked dangerous <laughs> I was like worried for his health
And then, yeah, just in awe, really, of Sung Hoon. It was really nice. Great introduction to the variety show. Made me smile. Made me happy. And I kind of just want to watch another one right away. But I don't know which one I would pick. I did, definitely didn't get that far. I'll have a look and I'll see what I can find. All right, that is it for now. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, let me know what you think down in the comments below. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye!